Speaking of friends, our next letter is from R. Pakula. They write, Do you know how you became Jonah's guardian angel? Do you remember? Yo, what's going on my people? Guys, we are back doing another quick reaction video for you guys today. Today we are checking out the angel hair tape, so this is going to be very interesting. I got in this interest since we've seen the first video on Subscribe Pro Movie Night, which is very interesting. So I thought, why not just check out the whole entire series as a whole right now today? But I'm going to be real with you guys. I was originally going to do a gameplay for you guys today, but... I'm not really feeling it. I'm kind of kind of out of it. On top of that, I'm not really feeling 100% today. So I just thought, why not just throw this in here for you guys? So I hope you guys will enjoy today's video. And yeah, let's go ahead and dive on in. Let's do it. All right, guys. So first tape was called Tape 1, Where Were You an Angel Hair Child? Let's go ahead and check this out, guys. 3 minutes 19. And I believe this is the same one we've seen in Subscriber Movie Night to start us off. So let's go. So this one won't be very new to me. I'll say that. It's still creepy. I don't care. It's still creepy. Angel Gabby. Oh, Angel Gabby. <laughs> Good morning, Francis. I love to hear you call. Oh. Have you brought a new friend with you? Yes, but I'm fearful, Angel Gabby. I never know what to say. That's okay, Francis. Meeting new people doesn't have to be scary. Just introduce yourself and ask them to do the same. <clears throat> Stop looking at Hello me. Hello there. My name is Angel Gabby. What's yours? That's a beautiful name. It's wonderful to meet you, and I hope we can be friends. Fear should never control you, Francis. I'll show you how to meet someone new. First, you introduce yourself and ask them to do the same. <clears throat> Stop looking at me. Hello there. <laughs> My name is Angel Gabriel. What's yours? It's wonderful to meet you, Jonah. I hope I can be a good friend to you. Another way to make friends is to share things you like. Can you think of a toy or storybook that's special to you? That's great! Sharing something important lets others learn about what makes you special. Another way to make friends is to share things you like. Can you think of a toy or storybook that's special to you? God, that is That's a great creepy, book. Dude. Just like Babe, you can grow up to do whatever you want, Jonah. That's what makes you special. Yeah, that's still creepy. <laughs> still creepy, dude. Even even after already checking out this first tape, it's still just as creepy as when I first seen it. But yeah, guys, um, we've seen this one on Subscribe Whole Movie Night. Let's just dive right on into the next episode. Tried to wait. I tried to find any information I could about this show. Other versions, regions, releases. KP Publishing. Old kid show, but when they grew up in the 90s, the original publisher. Read the flight. It doesn't show up anywhere. Not online, no business records. Oh! Why's their eyes, bro? It's a beautiful day, Francis. We shouldn't take it for granted. Oh, but Gabby, how can I have the strength to face the day? All the rain has got me shivering and sad. Why is it flickering like that? Oh, Francis, it's simple. 
Faith and hope give us the strength to face every challenge. It may not make us physically strong, but it can give us resolve and fortitude when we need it. I could certainly use some fortitude. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand why it would be different for me. The sun is warm sometimes, Jonah, but you shouldn't forget the moments when it burns you. Oh, that Gabby, how can I have the strength to face the day? All the rain has got me shivery and sad. You will need strength to be resilient during times of comfort, and fortitude to be brave during times of heat. What the heck? I can show you how to be stronger, use some fortitude. even though you're so small. <laughs> <laughs> that rabbit evil. That rabbit is evil. Uh, the rain man. has flooded the path back to my home. How will I ever cross? Oh, despair. You'll never cross if you give in to despair, friend Francis. Let's follow the stream and look for a narrow crossing. This will do us a lot more good than surrendering to despair. I see, Gabby. This hope is giving me a lot of strength. I thought it was like shit. Rain has flooded the path back to my home. How will I ever cross? Oh, despair. In the darkest times, you must never despair, Jonana. It is our greatest enemy. Strength will be your ally, and I will show you how to be strong. I see, Gabby. This hope is giving me a lot of strength. What? We feel safest where we go to sleep. Do you want your room to feel safe? That she always knew that I needed. First, let me show you how what? you can be stronger than your enemy. Like David's little pebble against Goliath, this little chair is going to be stronger than anyone who comes to your door. If we put it backwards like this, it will be like your own lock and key. Look at that! It's so strong! Now let's get in the closet. What do the you dark mean? can be scary, but it can also be peaceful. Instead of letting the sounds and darkness make you fearful, look at God's blessings and concentrate hard on something you're thankful for. This is how your mind can be strong, too. I like to take a big, slow breath to keep me calm. <sighs> Would you like to try? Very good, Jonah. Now you don't have to be scared. Even if he finds you. He? Who is he? <laughs> My mom and I. Wait, hold, hold up! Bro, what? <laughs> that dude, that opened a freaking can of worms. What the heck did that- Bro, this is crazy. The, 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 dude, I need to see what happens next. This is crazy, man. I, all I need to know is who the heck is he, bro? And honestly, at first I thought the angel hair maybe was evil now I'm, I'm not thinking that maybe not i'm not too sure let's let's just keep going i want to see where this ends up all right kp lost media letters with angel gabby that's a two minute long one letters with angel gabby hello there no i'm not angel gabby she's busy today so i have the privilege of answering your questions on her behalf I sure hope I can do a good job for y'all. All right. Our first letter is from Bleeding Heart Doves. She asks if there are any other angel hairs. What a lovely question. Thank you, Bleeding Heart Doves. Personally, I haven't met any angels other than Gabby. She's my dearest friend. My only friend, really. Anyway, there's certainly more angel hairs out there, but they have a lot of responsibilities that keep them very busy. Here's some art I've collected over time of some of Gabby's angel friends. Aren't they lovely? That look kind of creepy. It's too realistic, Our my guy. Our next question is from Stephanie. <laughs> Thanks for writing, Steph. Oh, my. She writes, are there any demon hairs? As a matter of fact, there's quite a diverse lexicon of... <laughs> well, uh, she doesn't like me talking about all that. What? Hold Sometimes, on, man. when Gabby and I get a little giddy together, she'll tell some stories. I sure wish I could share more, but just know that demon hairs don't always appear as plainly as a rabbit with horns. 
Sometimes they look like an opportunity or a failing. Well, I'm sure glad you wrote to us, Steph, and Gabby sends her love. Or a Keep writing in, friends. Gabby loves to hear you call. Bro, 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 hold, hold the heck up. What if Gabby was like a demon in disguise, bro? Like, <laughs> I don't know. Dude, I got so many questions. I got questions, bro. I don't know what to believe in. She broke character mid-show? I'll feel safer with this, the way you wield that sword. These are nice props to demonstrate God's armor. But remember, Francis, the real sword of the spirit isn't a weapon. Ephesians says it's the sharp wit and powerful depth of his word. Oh, good. I'm no good at fighting actual battles. None not once if he's not coming back for a while. Huh? I'll pray for you. Who is- Jonah, you're a very brave and very special one of God's children. No, no, it's it's all right if you weren't listening. Do you remember what we decided to do if you're ever afraid? Is that even possible? I want you to take that off the table very carefully, only holding the handle. It might be heavy. Use both hands. Can you hold it up so I can see what kind it is? She talking about a gun? What's she, bro? That sound like a, she's talking about only the handle, bro. Now that we've got the pieces apart, let's think of somewhere to hide them where nobody can use them for harm. Dude, it's a gun. It's gotta be a gun. Dude. No, Jonah. Not the kitchen. A lot of people hide things in the kitchen and there's too much traffic for it to be safe. Hmm. No, not the toy chest in your room. It would be very incriminating. We can learn that word later, but it could get you into trouble. Oh, is happening. <laughs> good, good. Now, see if you can put the book back in front of it. Wonderful job. Be slow and steady as you climb back down. I think the belt of truth doesn't quite fit around me. Does that mean I'm extra honest? Or... I'll always be well, your warrior, case, Jonah. Where did she go? I hope we'll never have to draw a weapon. But as your guardian angel, I'll always be ready. Dude! Okay. Um. Who the heck? I, what I'm thinking, maybe the person that they're talking about, maybe an abusive relative? That's what I'm getting from this. Maybe a step, maybe a stepdad. I, I, I'm I'm not too sure, man. This is freaking creepy, disturbing, but interesting in all of the weirdest ways possible. <laughs> this is crazy, but it's a very unique way of storytelling, which I'm really really enjoying. So let's do, let's dive on into the next one, bro. Let's go. I should be frightened. I should be confused. But there's only. Although I love you, sense it's of dread that something happens. I won't be waiting when yeah, you call. I'm sorry, Gabby. I was scared you'd be mad at me, but I shouldn't have lied. No, you shouldn't have. It hurt my feelings that you would take one of my angel feathers, but it hurt me so much more that you would lie about it, Francis. Will you ever forgive me? The Bible tells us to forgive. But Proverbs 19 also warns us about the consequences of lying. Do you think we should forgive Francis now that he's apologized? We should? That's very nice of you. It shows a lot of courage to be merciful toward others. Francis, I forgive you. That's so kind of you, Gabby. She's like a completely different person. I'm sorry, Gabby. I was scared you'd be mad at me. But I shouldn't have lied. Honesty is important, Jonah. You should always tell the truth. If you know you're going to be in trouble, you should create a truth for later. 
Will you ever forgive me? Go to a friend's house when something bad happens, and you won't have to lie about it when they ask you later. What do you mean? They are going to ask you what happened, Jonah. So you have to make sure you're gone when the time comes. We have to make sure you only have truth to tell. She's planning my alibi. But I forget. Alibi for what the you can forgive Francis if you want, but it will be difficult to ever trust him again. Revelations warns us of the place prepared for liars. It's up to you, Jonah. What would you like me to do? Ah, oh, hey, no. No, I'm looking at the What? It's so good of you. It's, it's all right. Take your time and think about it. It's not an easy decision. Water crews arrived and were able to essentially close the floodgates, but not before the damage was done. I was thinking the same thing. I'll help you however I can. Bro, I'm so confused. <laughs> Dude, she plan she's planning our main character their alibi for what something's about to go down guys you probably know more than me let me know in the comments down below um yo this is getting crazier and crazier every episode i i am confused i don't know if i should trust this freaking hair or not but let, let's go on to the next one let's get it I don't want to scare me So I haven't told her why I'm here. Search for anything for my childhood. I didn't expect that. And more VHS tapes. So much. Children may break many balloons, and the experimenter may try to find out whether he feels any guilt about the destruction. When the wind blows, the cradle rocks, the bow breaks, and down come our babies, cradles and all. Children witnessing violent events on television. Beginning at one year of age, the child is trying to interpret... What the heck is it, bro? He feels danger. Get back to your home. That are a little different. Whether it's exposure to the television programming itself or the family and social conditions that lead to children spending a lot of time watching it. Unfortunately, if the child does not smile, we cannot infer that he is not comprehending the event. If it's the programming itself, the burden appears to fall on the film industry. Whatever the combination is, it seems to be a fairly lethal combination. Not until I find out. How to find my One of their neighbors kept on looking for them until they were found. If placed in a dark room, he would probably open his eyes while searching. Meanwhile, as an old friend used to say, good night and good luck. Bruh. <laughs> Dude, just digging deeper into the secrets of everything right now, trying to discover things, and I honestly don't know if our main protagonist is even going to uh, tell their mom about any of this. Wait, never, never hide. Huh? Never, never hide. What the heck that's supposed to mean? Oh, we got another letters with Angel Gabby. Uh-oh, here we go. Hello there. 
Bro. I'm afraid Angel Gabby couldn't be here today, but she's so thrilled with all the mail that's come in. You said that last time, man. Y'all are really writing a lot. There's so much of it. <laughs> I'll do my best to get He's through as much it, as bro. I can. Let's see. Here's a couple. Honey Bunny asks if there are other types of angel animals, and Tin Moose wants to know if there are other magical creatures. What fascinating questions. Thanks for being so curious, you two. Of course there are other magical creatures. Gabby isn't magical, after all. If you see a magical creature, it's probably an unholy apparition trying to lure you into trouble. Trust me, even the friendly ones can be a wolf in sheep's clothing. As for other angel animals... I didn't animals, know, bruh. Let's see, what do we have next? The heck was that? Koi asks if there is anyone in the woods besides the angel and the badger. My, my name is Francis. And Natalia asks if there will be more friends showing up. Well, don't worry, Natalia and Koi. The forest is always buzzing with life. Today's just a little quiet. Okay, next we have a couple letters from Mary Stone and Doom Gamer 3000. What lovely names. Thanks for writing, friends. They ask what Gabby's duties are, and if other angels like to come down and help. I think you'll be interested to know that Gabby has a lot of very busy angel friends. They have a lot of work to do all over the world, and their duty is to help those in need. If you keep an eye out, maybe you'll spot your local angel hair hopping around and helping people. Alrighty. Next is a letter from Frog. Frog asks how we get these letters, and if we know where they're coming from. What a funny question. We get our letters through the mail like everyone else, Frog. And they come from curious little writers just like you tuning in to watch your friends. Speaking of friends, our next letter is from R. Pakula. They write, Do you know how you became Jonah's guardian angel? Do you remember anything about Jonah? Inky Lemon asks how high can He Gabby didn't fly? even answer what the a question. Funny question. Thanks for writing, Inky Lemon. I've seen Gabby fly so high, she disappears right into the sun. I don't know how to measure it in units of science, but she certainly is a good flyer. That's all the time we have for today, friends. Oh, no, he had demon. I he had demon. No. Nope. I hope you'll stay in touch. He got three arms. It's very arm. comforting to know so many of you want to learn more about Gabby. She loves to hear you call. Goodbye. <laughs> Wait a minute, there's another letter here from a Vinay, 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 Never mind, I, I can't pronounce it. <laughs> Yo, why you sound like me when I'm bad at pronouncing names? What did you do, Nathan? Wait, what? Bro, I am, dude. I uh, is is that freaking was the dude reading the letters? Is he a demon, bro? That's what I'm thinking. He may be. He may be a demon. I don't know. This whole cartoon confuses me. <laughs> this VHS tape series, honestly, have me second guessing myself through the whole entire thing so far. But this is uh, tape six, a final call. Two minutes seventeen. Let's get it. I, I'm. I don't know what we about to get into. That's a lovely drawing, Jonah. <laughs> That's silly, Jonah. People can't fly. Don't worry. We can stay here as long as you need me to. Live stream an episode. I hope you're having as much fun as I am. I'm letting her out, dude. That's a, probably a bad idea. The colors show other animals that they're dangerous. We can be dangerous too, Jonah. What you mean by that? We can keep them away with just our banner. Bro, what the heck she talking about? Okay. Angel Gabby. Oh, Angel Gabby. Hello. Um. 
Gabriel? <laughs> Angel Gabby? Good morning, Francis. I love to hear you call. Have you brought a new friend with you? Yes, but I'm fearful, Angel Gabby. I never know what to say. Oh my god. What? Um, it's, it's me. Jonah, I'm here. Do you remember me? I'm so happy to see you, Jonah. <laughs> Just look how well you've grown. Okay, maybe she is an uh, evil entity after all. Okay, that's fine. I, I'm, I'm cool with happy endings. What the heck was that supposed to mean? What? Okay, guys, I literally thought that was it, but turns out there's more. There's an Easter tape, cracked shells, and there's a lot more underneath. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just watch one more, and then we're probably going to just chop it up into maybe a part two or something. I don't want this video to be too long, but let's go. This is This is crazy, bro. Excuse me. Must have been my first Easter alone. Hello. Happy Easter. He is risen. He is risen indeed, Francis. Are you ready to celebrate this special day with our friends? Oh, yes, Gabby. Only, I'm not sure how. Can you help? Of course. Will you follow along with us? That's great. So how do we start? We start with some eggs. Now we'll be using... Oh no, careful! That's why we'll be using boiled eggs. Let's get a parent to help, okay? No, no, with a parent. Oh, my. What are you talking about? She was so patient with me. All right. Now we have everything set up. Let's go over our materials. We have hard-boiled eggs, cups full of dyed water, and paints. Now, egg painting comes from an early Mesopotamian metaphor for the Holy Trinity, and Christians would paint them red to represent the crucifixion. But today, we can paint whatever we like in all sorts of colors. We can paint whatever we like? Well... I would paint something that matters to you, like a special flower, favorite image, or missing memory. Ooh, fun! Missing memory? Now, first we have to dye the egg to get a base color we can paint on top of. You have to be careful, because dye is a potent stain. So, if you use your spoons to carefully lower your... See, now your hands are going to stay that color. I'm all done, Gabby. The heck is that? Actually, I'll take that, Francis. How about you try another one? All right. Okay. Now that your eggs she just threw it. and hands and shirt are all dyed, we can get to the paint. Remember that eggs are round, so we have to cover each and every side of them. I like to surround my egg in palm fronds to remind me of promises made. How does this look, Gabby? Make another, Francis. <laughs> all right. Oh, what? careful! Did he have like, a all rabbit the head on that's the egg. X'd out, bro? No, no, we'll eat them later. Once it's dry and out of the shell. Look what I made, Gabby. Mm. Uh, I'll start again. It's okay. The egg itself is just for I fun. think he's possessed, bro. It's surreal to remember this. What's important is to remember the message which is that someone was willing to die to keep you from harm. You can always have faith in that, Jonah. Happy Easter. I want to share it with her. Angel he went Gabby. back live? Oh, Angel Gabby. She ain't there, bro. Angel Gabby. Gabby. <laughs> Gabby. <laughs> Angel Gabby. <laughs> oh, 
Angel Gabby. Yeah, we we lost two. We we lost two. I I have no clue, man. Gabby. Dude. Okay. So I'm gonna. I don't know how many more episodes we have left, guys. Let's see. We got. Dang. We got a lot more. Holy god, yeah, yeah, we, we're gonna have to stop it right here, guys. This was freaking crazy, and it is a huge rabbit hole. I'm not, I, I'm literally no pun intended, but this literally have been the craziest rabbit hole of VHS tapes I've seen in a while, story-wise. And, and all course of, you know, animation and stuff was freaking great, too. But boy, <laughs> this is crazy. All right, guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, this analog horror series from the East Patch. So I hope you guys show them some love. If you want to go ahead and check out the rest of the series yourself, then please go ahead and do so. I'm going to have to cut this into a, maybe a part one and then do a part two another time. But I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. And again, like I said, today was meant to be a gameplay. But your boy, not I'm not feeling too well on top of that too, guys. I want to actually just take a day and just record a bunch of gameplay for you guys so we can have a bunch of side series along with our main series and i do have a three random christmas horror games that's dropping for you guys too um along with um the first episode of kindergarten and on top of that two finishing help wanted because i want to beat that game it's a whole lot of stuff i'm trying to do guys along with some exe videos because it's been a minute since i recorded some but regardless hope you guys enjoyed today's video go ahead hit that sub button help your boy out join the legendary army today if you guys got any other analog horror you want me to watch in the future then please go ahead recommend me some you can follow me on twitter or x or you can join the community discord too that's fine but regardless appreciate you guys being here with me and uh yeah besides that, i'll see you all in the next one peace